we would say that there's uh, two main areas. Uh, the first is the overall themes that I noticed were um, that we are all part of one community but, but work in different neighborhoods. So whether that be from a policy standpoint, whether it be practitioners on the ground, uh, everybody's talking the same language with a slightly different dialect. Uh, there is uh, another moment where um, uh, one of the, the folks uh, mentioned that uh, the plural of anecdote is not experience. And I thought that was very, very interesting for me in the sense that we need to ground what we're doing in much more evidence than just um, you know, our intuitive anecdotes here or there that this is what we see, this is what we're being told versus what do we actually know about the issue at hand. I think the, the most uh, important action item that I, I would take away from today for, for me specifically in my work and the work in student affairs is the importance of case management in the sense that uh, we are we're interacting with a series of different students with complex mental health needs and uh, because of the, the setup of the university and the silos and the small city that we work within, trying to support those students to get the help they need efficiently, uh, we really need to have uh, either a function or a person focused on case management so nobody falls through the cracks. Uh, another action item is, uh, and some learning I took away from today, is that we need a limited amount of, of uh, next steps. So uh, although it's not necessarily clear exactly which ones we're taking, somewhere around the three to five next steps needs to emerge in the next few months. Um, the last one is that uh, we talked about planning and uh, several times it was mentioned uh, that we have to get very clear on who does what with whom, how, and why. Uh, and so I'm certainly taking that back to my operation to figure out exactly how we would answer that question and map that out.